Hello and welcome to Systems and Solutions. We have a couple of products here that we'd like to share with you. Well, and a couple of three. A couple of three <laughs> products that we'd like to share with you. Um, one, two, three. Um, so, Matthew, would you like to introduce us into the first one? Certainly. Um, the first one we have, Gabby, is a NAS box, which stands for Network Attached Storage. Um, so what this allows you to do is um, plug into your, this into your network um, and give you a centralised place where you can access all of your stuff from. Oh, um, so it's like sharing all of your files in the house? That's right, yeah. Yeah, it's exactly what it does. So um, most people have got more than one computer in their house these days with tablets and phones and just about everything else. Mm. So what you can do, um, if you wanted, you could take all of your stuff on all of your computers, you know, movies, videos, iTunes, um, music. Like important documents and stuff Important like documents well. if you wanted to do that as well. You put it all on here. Um, it's got a 500 gig um, hard disk in it, so there's plenty of storage capacity and you can upgrade that because it can take um, two hard disks in there and hard disk nowadays you can get up to around about sort of like three or four terabytes on a single hard disk so, so can you put more than one hard drive in there yeah yeah you can have two hard disks there it comes with one um but it's relatively straightforward to upgrade it to um to two um, and they can be set up so they're two independent hard disks or they can be set up in what's known as a, a mirrored mode so one hard disk is a carbon copy of the other so it you know works to back your stuff up really oh uh, right so so in case like something happens to the one disc then it falls back onto the that's other right one. yeah oh excellent um and what about um plugging any other devices in there yep yeah, you've got two usb ports on there so you'll be able to plug in um, printers it can act as a print server you can also plug in um, other um, usb hard disks as well so either add more storage back it up transferring stuff onto there really quite a flexible product Excellent, excellent. Right, so um, and how much is that going to set us back? Um, well, originally they were um, £95 um, and we've now reduced that down to £65, so get yourself a bargain. That is very, very good. So once again, that's the Mi Box that's and, right. uh, and is it, it's also known as a NAS Box, is that right? That's right, yeah. Mi Box is the, uh, this particular company's branding of it, but um, yeah, they're NAS Network Attached Storage. Excellent, okay. So... Um, Sounds like a really good product. Absolutely, great. Right, so what's the next one we're going to go to? <laughs> okay then. So um, the next thing we're going to have a quick look at is um, this optical smart hub um, by Samsung. And um, this is a wireless CD um, oh, like a drive. So you can... Is it like obviously DVDs, CDs? Yeah, CDs, DVDs, um, you can burn, it's a CD and DVD burner as well, so you can copy information to the DVD or CD. Um, and really it's designed around um, sharing device, you know, sharing with things that don't have a um, built-in CD player. So netbooks, iPads, that yeah, kind of thing. Does exactly it, does it that. Yeah. The board from yeah, it's um, all of the software um, you can get from both the iTunes um, store and the Google um, Play Store. That's really good. Yeah, absolutely. It's a, you know really quite an interesting product. More and more people these days have got sort of phones and tablets and all the rest of it. You could just stick your entire CD collections on your phone or your tablet if you wanted to. Um, and likewise as well, you could actually sort of make a make a backup of the stuff you've got on your phone or tablet straight okay. onto that yeah wow and uh, I mean that just sounds that sounds really good mm. pretty much everything now like you know even like notepads and like all, the whole mm. they just get rid of the CD oh right? absolutely so, yeah. yeah you will find a lot of this you know uh, so many things these days the, the popular thing to do is to make these small form factor units so things like small laptops and all the rest of it they're great um, and CDs almost seem extinct but mm. you can guarantee when you need to use a cd you've got a laptop yeah. that hasn't got a cd <laughs> drive on it and also even if you wanted to plug in um an external cd player mm. you couldn't really because you haven't got the usb ports on some of them yeah you? that's right yeah, yeah you have yeah very limited so yeah oh excellent very good so how much is that one um they are 32 pounds <laughs> 32 pounds yeah. excellent no that is really good Lovely. Right, next one. Um, and then finally, um, we have a um, business card scanner. Ooh. So, um, 
what these are designed around doing is you can plug your um, business card scanner into your computer and mm -hmm. um, it's got some software that goes along with it um, at the same time as well um, and you just feed business cards into it. Oh uh, right, so say for instance like um, so loads of people that like, come to you with their business cards rather than you having to like enter in all the details from it, mm. you can just scan them in and it goes straight onto a database? Exactly that, yeah. So it's got its own software, it will also take that into programs like Excel and Outlook so you can manage your contacts through there. Um, I mean, the other thing that's just incredible with this is just how small it is. I mean, the box does make it look quite big, so we'll actually get the thing out and have a quick look at it because it's certainly yeah, cause I know, very like, portable. Yeah, I mean, you know, I've seen loads of people that have got stacks and stacks of business mm. cards are like, you know, in like a drawer somewhere and they're just completely, you know... Absolutely, it certainly helps reduce the clutter. Now, it's not going to fit into your pocket, obviously, <laughs> but it certainly doesn't take up that much room. Mm. And interestingly enough, yeah, let's hold up. for the geeks out there, there it's go. one of the few devices I've seen that connects to a computer using an A to A USB connection. <laughs> it's worth buying it just for that reason. Yeah. There we go, that's the card there. So you put the cards in the top. That's right, right yeah. So you and in fact, the other thing you can do as well um, with the um, software they provide you with is you can use that on a normal scanner. So it just uses um, sort of a, what's known as OCR, so Optical Character Recognition Software. So you can use any scanner on there. So if you've got 10 business cards, you're obviously going to take um, a few minutes to stick 10 business cards through this. Mm -hmm. um, you could stick them on a flatbed scanner, scan those cards, and it will import that data into the program for you. Wow, so you can do, yeah, that is really good. Excellent. So that's that product there. And did we say how much this was going to be? We didn't say how much that was going to be. Right. Um, that is, uh, it was 90. It was 90. Probably that's so. a lot. <laughs> However, you can get yours today for only 45 pounds. 45? 45, half price. That is really good. So if you want a business card scanner for 45 pounds, yep. we've got one here for you. Right, so those are the um, three products that we yep. wanted to show you today. So thank you for uh, watching and everything and stay tuned for probably more products we're gonna- I would imagine so, in. yeah. Yeah, why not? Let's just do them, let's do them. Okay, take care, bye-bye. Bye. That was all right. Yeah, We had worked. fun. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>